Welcome to our video, where we delve into the profound influence of the legendary Leo Messi on Major League Soccer, or MLS, in the United States. Behind the excitement of his arrival, Messi's presence has sparked a series of transformations that are reshaping both the league and the perception of soccer in America. But his impact goes far beyond just his mesmerizing skills on the field. Let's uncover the significant shifts that Messi has ignited in MLS. Leo Messi's entry into Major League Soccer, or MLS, triggered a significant shift, centering on the ongoing debate over artificial turf in the MLS stadiums. Prior to his arrival, numerous clubs utilized synthetic grass, which has long been criticized for its propensity to cause injuries and negatively impact gameplay. However, Messi's presence intensified this concern, particularly regarding his well-being and longevity in the league. The Argentine star's stature and skill set prompted heightened scrutiny on the playing surface, leading to extensive dialogues among MLS management and team owners about the feasibility of substituting artificial turf with natural grass. This deliberation gained traction due to Messi's performance on natural grass, emphasizing the need to provide an optimal environment for his performance. Potentially sidelined by injuries incurred on artificial turf posed not only a risk to the star player, but also a significant challenge for MLS as his absence could lead to financial and reputational losses. The prospect of replacing synthetic grass gains momentum, reflecting the profound impact that Messi's arrival has already brought to the league's infrastructure, player well-being, and future trajectory. Presently, artificial turf is a contentious topic affecting six MLS clubs, among them Seattle Saunders and Portland Timbers. Leo Messi's imminent participation in matches played on the synthetic surface has acted as a catalyst for intensive deliberations within MLS management regarding the implementation of natural grass for regular season games. Don Garber, MLS commissioner, has revealed a groundbreaking shift in policy. Clubs are now able to deliberate the substitution of artificial turf with natural grass for regular league matches. This announcement marks a pivotal moment in MLS history, reflecting the league's recognition of the significance of playing conditions and players' preferences. Messi's arrival in MLS has triggered a significant discourse centered around altering kickoff times. The strategic consideration is driven by the desire to capture the attention of the highly coveted European audience, known for its fervent devotion to soccer. As the sun sets over American stadiums, a unique opportunity arises to align match timings with European prime time, enhancing viewership from across the Atlantic. MLS's proactive engagement with the demographic underscores the league's aspiration to establish a global footprint and tap into new markets. This move not only showcases MLS's commitment to growth, but also illustrates its willingness to adapt and cater to the preferences of the international fan base. Messi's influence goes beyond his on-field prowess, reshaping the very fabric of MLS and propelling it onto the global stage with a newfound relevance. Friends, this strategic shift in kickoff times could attract soccer enthusiasts from both North America and Europe, tapping into a broader fan base and potentially boosting international interest in MLS. The increased viewership could lead to higher television ratings, sponsorship deals, and advertising revenue, ultimately contributing to the league's financial growth. Also, appealing to the transatlantic audience could foster a sense of international camaraderie among soccer fans, creating a shared experience that spans continents. However, it's essential to consider potential challenges, such as coordinating with players' schedules, managing travel logistics, and ensuring that local fans are not disadvantaged by the adjusted timings. The significance of Messi's presence in MLS can be likened to a pivotal point in the league's history, the introduction of designated players. Much like how David Beckham's entry in 2007 had a transformative impact, Messi's arrival has sparked conversations about the need to potentially revise the designated player rule to ensure a more balanced distribution of talent across MLS teams. Designated players, often referred to as DPs, are players whose salaries exceed the team's salary cap, allowing teams to sign high-profile and internationally recognized talent. David Beckham's signing was a watershed moment for MLS, as it not only brought attention from around the world, but also elevated the league's profile and credibility. Messi's entry can be seen as having a similar response due to his immense global popularity and remarkable playing career. However, the presence of such high-profile players can also lead to concerns about competitive balance. The discussions surrounding Messi's arrival have led to considerations about how the designated player rule might be adjusted to prevent an excessive concentration of star talent in a few teams. The aim could be to create a more level playing field by ensuring that teams across the league have the opportunity to attract and sign top-notch players. 
The existing rule in MLS permits clubs to recruit up to three high-earning designated players, often considered stars to the rosters. While this approach has undoubtedly led to the acquisition of remarkable talents and increased the league's overall profile, it also introduces a level of pressure on these designated players to consistently deliver outstanding performances. This pressure can render teams somewhat vulnerable, as their success can become heavily dependent on the individual contributions of these star players. In recent discussions about the future of MLS and its competitive landscape, club owners and league officials have been contemplating on a more balanced approach. The aim is to reduce the reliance on a small group of high-earning players and distribute talent more evenly across teams. This move toward balance seeks to enhance competitiveness to the league and minimize the risk of a few teams dominating solely due to the performances of their designated players. By promoting a more egalitarian distribution of talent, clubs can work toward building well-rounded teams with strength across all positions. This approach can lead to greater team cohesion, tactical versatility, and overall stability, reducing the vulnerability that comes with relying heavily on a select group of star players. It also aligns with the broader goal of ensuring that the success of MLS is sustainable and not solely reliant on the presence or performance of a few marquee names. Potential adjustments to the designated player rule might involve revising salary cap implications, introducing mechanisms to encourage teams to invest in youth development and scouting, or even exploring ways to incentivize the recruitment of players from a wide range of backgrounds and skill sets. The inclusion of players of the caliber of Demaria, Inistia, and others in MLS has the potential to significantly enhance clubs' rosters without over-reliance on a limited number of designated players. This shift could lead to a more dynamic and engaging league that benefits from a wider pool of experienced and skilled players. Bringing in players like Demaria and Inistia, who have played in the highest levels of European and international soccer, can elevate the overall quality of play in MLS. These players possess valuable experience, technical expertise, and tactical intelligence that can influence not only the performance of their respective teams, but also the development of young talent within the league. By diversifying the talent base beyond designated players, clubs can achieve a more balanced team composition. This can lead to greater adaptability in different match scenarios, more creative and strategic gameplay, and a higher level of competition overall. As a result, matches are likely to become more engaging and unpredictable, captivating the attention of fans and viewers. In just a matter of weeks, Leo Messi has already ignited a series of changes that are transforming MLS and the perception of soccer in the United States. As the league evolves and strives for excellence, one thing is certain, Messi's impact on MLS is a game changer that will continue to reshape the future of soccer in America. So guys, that's it for today's video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel.